Hello everyone, this is me, Satya here, and I'm back with the remaining month of August reads. Start from the 22nd through the 31st of the August 2022. This reading is going to be for the sign of uh, Leo. So Leos, let's see what is coming up for you for the remaining month of August time. I will be adding oracle cards, messages from your person and energy cards for your person. So stay tuned and before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it is a general read. It may and it may not resonate with everyone out there. So always pick the signs and messages that resonate and so leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID. In the description box, you can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's dive into the read and let's find out what is coming up for Leo's for the remaining month of August time. Let's begin. Knight of Swords. Four of Swords. The Hierophant. I feel like, you know, you will be getting yourself in, in a lot of legal matters in this uh, remaining month's time. Um, make sure that whatever you do, whatever you choose to do in the remaining month's time, you are very careful with the, what you choose to do and how you choose to do it. Because I feel like, you know, there are some sort of legal liabilities that you will be having in uh, the remaining month's time. Make sure you are aware of what is going on on that area. Because I really feel like, you know, there's a lot that needs to be... Um, you know, uh, there's a lot that needs to be done. There's a lot to be uh, understood. There's a lot to be taken care of when it comes to the legal matters of things that are happening in your life. So I feel like and it's very important for you to take care of things. Um, make sure you know the details of certain things in your life. And especially when it comes to, um, you know, uh, legal matters that, uh, that involves money, uh, finances, uh, buying or selling things I feel like and it's very important for you to be aware of what you're choosing to do um, there is um, there is a possibility of you picking up argument fight with uh, someone if you don't get into the matter uh, the right way so I really feel like you know it can be um, um, it can be a warning for you to be very careful with money matters in the um, in, in the month of uh, in the remaining month of August but let's see what else is happening for you in uh, in your life in the remaining month time of august because i really see it to be like money 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 there's something else um maybe for some of you you might be investing yourself a lot into the money matters in the remaining month time maybe you are so occupied with money 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 that maybe for some of you you are going to be neglecting other areas of your life which could result into some sort of uh, issues with your partner as well or issues with your kids as well so especially if you are already dealing with a lot of struggles when it comes to your love life because of your work because of your finances i feel like you know the tough uh, time is uh, going to get tougher especially if you have been ignoring your love life because of your work situations it can be energy of your person too who has been indulging into um heavily into into money matters how um, maybe you are going to feel like ne neglected maybe you're going to feel like your life is kind of upside down maybe you're not going to be happy because your person is not giving you what you deserve what you desire and i feel like you know that's going to mess your life up in the remaining month's time you're going to feel neglected by this person um i feel like you know it's going to be very hard for you to trust and have faith in the connection in the situation especially if your person ignores you uh, because i feel like uh it's very important whether you are on the giving side or whether you're on the receiving side it's very important to keep the balance maintained i feel like somebody is definitely investing too much into work finances right now and um there's a strong 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 possibility of whoever it is that is investing too much into money will have some issues coming in um i feel like it can be because of the overdoing of uh, you know overspending themselves into money matters like you know energetically i would say so make sure you know what you are doing with money in the remaining month's time because there is some sort of unpleasant um, energy coming in for you in your life because of the money situation that you're getting yourself into i don't know why i'm picking up uh, that energy but yes be sure that you that you know what you're doing with money during the remaining month time but if things work out for you um, you will be earning a lot in the remaining month time for some of you. I feel like, you know, you're, you are definitely getting abundance, um, but be careful with legal matters. Be very careful with that. But for majority of you, I really see you earning a lot 
earning a lot of uh, financial stability though let's see what is it that is um your person currently thinking about you because i feel like maybe you're so invested in money um and love life is being ignored let's see what is your person thinking about you right now <sighs> feeling left out um uh, disappointed too but still somebody really loves you somebody really believes that you are the one for them so I feel like you know even though if you are ignoring them they are going to be sticking around because they love you so much um, they will be finding it hard to be positive but at the same time I feel like you know somebody has to understand that you know to maintain a healthy life you have to have a healthy balance in your life overall I really see you invested into finances your love life is being compromised here but at the same time um, somebody's not gonna give up on you I feel like they they love you so much so to the point where they're not gonna be like letting the uh, you know the ongoing issues affect the connection in any negative way they're gonna be sticking around for majority of you <laughs> let's see the messages from your person let's see what do they wish to say here what are their love messages from there from from the one that you are you know um, connected with let's see their messages for you what do they wish to say here what do they wish to say here what are their love messages for you? Their messages for you. What is it that they wish to say here? We both know that I'm not the one for you. So somebody's really getting mad at you because they feel like we are not going to be happy. You know, we, we cannot be together. We cannot be the one for each other because of the way things are. So somebody's really getting mad. But at the same time, I feel like you know, even though there is going to be disappointment, but the love is pretty much strong the connection seems pretty much strong but yes uh, somebody is really unhappy yeah i wonder if you are happy without me so somebody is really questioning that you know being are uh, you being invested so much into work finances money they wonder at times are you happy without them because um i feel like you know you are so occupied you are so fucking occupied um please don't leave me so somebody is really um they are unhappy but at the same time um they, they you, you know i feel like you know this person is disappointed they feel left out and at times they feel like moving on but then what holds them back to you or brings them back to you is their love so they do love you um and um at the same time they're unhappy with the way things are the way you are unable to give them time um or vice versa for some of you then it just could be completely reversed maybe you're feeling neglected ignored but yes um i feel like you know this connection will stay will pass the test of time and things are going to be okay um let's see the oracle messages wow only time will tell so we have our two cards here one says only time will tell i feel like you know this connection seems very um positive in a way where the person you are dealing with even if you are ignoring them they're going to still feel that hope still is alive and uh, they really want uh, the time to unfold the the connections importance to you naturally they're not they might not do effort to make you understand their love both but um at the same time um they believe that only time will tell you how how important they are to you friendship nurture the bonds of friendship within your relationship and your love life will dramatically improve i feel like you know because of the workload because of the financial situations because of the burdensome energy is coming in your uh, work life finances um i really see your love life being compromised and um if you could have that healthy friendship, things would have been different. Because I feel like, you know, for the majority of you, you're, you are not having communication with your person. Uh, and the, again, the reason being how uh, somebody is really very busy here, uh, unable to give time to love. And that's the reason why the issues are coming, the issues are happening. But I feel like with time, things are going to be like, okay. But yeah, I really feel like, you know, the remaining month is going to be very much occupied. Um, you're going to feel occupied mentally, physically exhausted. Um... But yes, I feel like, you know, only time will heal the wounds that are happening right now or taking place for the other person that you are dealing with. But yes, um, I do see that with the passage of time, things are going to fall into place again. The communication will start. The bond of friendship is going to get stronger. So yeah, that's pretty much it coming up for you for this read. Um, for, for this read, if it was of help, do like, share, and subscribe till I do the next read for you guys. Take care. Bye.